things. Uh, Rick Self is here, and uh, he is with the Catholic Men's Conference. Uh, this is something that typically happens in the spring, as I recall. I think they've done three, two of them, three, <laughs> two so far. If that's, I've been to both of them, uh, and uh, we'll go to as many as they have going forward. So I'm going to talk to Rick about that in a little bit. And a couple of things we want to talk about in the remainder of the show. First of all, is a wonderful event that happens every year. The, the first two years, it's been at Prince of Peace Parish in Plano, um, which I love strictly for the alliteration of all those P's popping on in my microphone here. Prince of Peace Parish in Plano. Uh, Father Tom Clority has been kind enough to host that the last couple of years. It's the Catholic Men's Conference. And uh, here to talk about that is Rick Self, who has been, I think, involved for the last couple of years and involved again. He's even got his Catholic Brothers for Christ shirt on. So uh, how you doing, Rick? Good. I'm doing great. Thanks for having yeah, me sure here you hold today. that mic real up closer. Okay. Here. Can you hear? Yeah, there you go. Right. Sounds, right. sounds a lot better. I'm going to get a, a text here in a second. So right. Rick sounds too low, so I'm trying <laughs> okay, to preempt, preempt that. So. I'll speak loud and clear. Uh, thanks for being here, and tell us about this uh, this conference. I've been there the last two years. Mm. I've enjoyed it. You've got some great speakers. Uh, that uh, uh, guys like uh, Jesse Romero, uh, Al Cresta, as I, as I recall. You had the uh, uh, Brian Patrick one year. Mm -hmm. You had the whole crew from Crossing the Goal, the goal uh, on there. Um, what's the plan for this year? Do you have a date set, a location, speakers? Yes, I, I, I do. Say, I have all that information. Next, next year, so First of all, I want to say thanks for having me here. And, oh, sure. uh, but I'm here because my friend Kyle, uh, Dr. Abeline, is a great dentist. Um, I've, I've been coming to him for over two years, and what I like about Kyle is he, he's honest with what's going on with your teeth. He mm -hmm. doesn't fix things that don't need to be fixed, yeah. and, he, and he fixes things that need to be fixed. So that's a good trait of a dentist. So I highly recommend uh, Kyle and the family atmosphere that's here mm -hmm. at yeah. uh, Mid-Cities Dental. But uh, what I want to talk about is the 2015 North Texas Catholic Brothers for Christ Men's Conference. We've had them for two years now. They've both been at, uh, uh, in Plano at Prince of Peace. This year we're bringing it over to the Mid-Cities, actually in Hearst, at the new Hearst Convention Center. Oh, is that right? I yes. didn't know that. Very nice. Um, which it, this year we're also, it's going to be earlier than last year. It's going to be February 7th, which is Saturday before the, mm -hmm. the weekend before Lent begins. Um, it's at the Hearst Conference Center at, at 1601 Campus Drive in Hearst. Uh, this year's speakers, uh, outstanding speakers, Father Larry Richards is the keynote speaker, along with Tom Peterson and Michael Coran. So uh, we're very excited about this conference this year. We expect to have 1,000 to 1,500 men at this conference. Uh, last year we had just about 800 over at Prince of Peace, and we've kind of outgrown the facility at Prince of Peace. Mm -hmm, yeah. And the other reason, we just want to kind of be more centralized in the Metroplex. Yeah. And again, this is for all Catholic men or a non-Catholic, anybody who wants to come experience Father Larry Richards, uh, this is a great opportunity to do that. All right, let's uh, let's talk about these speakers. I think I know who all these are. Father Larry Richards, of course, I know him well. He was one of our speakers at our Summer Speaker Series event uh, a few years ago. Uh, very popular. He now, I don't know if you know this, he has uh, his own program on, on Catholic Radio. He's on... Thursdays at uh, 1 o'clock, I think, yeah, no, 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 2 o'clock on the open line. Uh, so he's on every week, and I think that's going to help build uh, awareness of him and who he is. Now, Tom Peterson, he's from Catholics Come Home, right? Yeah, that's right. He's from Catholics Come Home. He's, he's a great a great series, great uh, marketing for Catholics, um, mm -hmm. and he's going to do a, He's going to do a talk as well. Yeah, a few years ago, it's probably been, gosh, five, I don't know, five, six years ago, he started this. I, I want to say he's out of Denver, Colorado, or somewhere out west and was really trying to get those people that uh, are have left the church uh, for whatever reason and uh, he wants to draw them back in. It's been a big push in the church because we know that only about uh, 25 to 30 percent of Catholics are actually participating in the sacraments and the uh, you know going to mass every Sunday so his big push was to get those 70 75 percent of the people back into regular participation in, in the mass I did not know he was a speaker but uh, yeah is that he's, what he's going to talk about it, he's, that's exactly Catholics? right we're, we're really targeting men that are, are not really going to church not really practicing their Catholic faith and we're trying to get them back in the church we feel like there's a lot of Catholics that are that that just need to be re-energized and that's what he'll he'll provide as well and Michael Coran it has a great, a guy? Yes, yeah. has a great witness as well. Uh, so we're, we're lo looking forward to these three guys to come talk. We're also going to have mass and adoration and uh, reconciliation. And uh, it's going to be a great event all day Saturday, the uh, 7th of February. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, it's, it's a wonderful what's happening, uh, not only with this conference, but men's conferences across the country, and in Protestant and Catholic. You know, the Protestants got into it uh, a little bit early with the, uh, what was the name of that? Uh, that, that the, uh, uh, the Something Changers? <laughs> the Promise Keepers. Yeah, Promise, promise Keepers. keepers. There you yeah. go. Not the Promise Changers. Yeah. Okay, the Promise <laughs> promise Keepers. <laughs> that, that wouldn't quite be as... Uh, as a promise Keepers. This, uh, this okay, is similar the, to that. The promise it, Keepers, I think it was uh, the, the old Colorado football coach that got that started, and it became phenomenal popular and then the Catholics started to say wow you know uh, we need to get the men together and uh, I have thoroughly enjoyed the, the first two conferences so I uh, just want to uh, remind uh, men out there and if uh, the women are listening uh, you know uh, tell, tell your husband about this especially uh, there, there are some women whose husbands are not practicing the faith regularly I think you come to something like this and you see that uh, uh, how important it is for men I'm going on a retreat next week out in Louisiana focusing on men as leaders, providers, protectors, you know, and it's something that our, our wives want us to be, and uh, they want us to be the spiritual leaders of the family. It's not like something macho. It's something that uh, most, the, the vast majority of women want the men to step up and be the spiritual leaders of their family, because mm -hmm. they've got so much else to do in, you know, with, with the kids as well. So February 7th, Hearst Convention Center, Center. is that right? That's and right. What's the location of that again? It's 1601 Campus Drive in Hearst. Uh, okay. Right off precinct line, you can't mess it. It's a huge uh, convention center, very state of the art. The other thing, the uh, theme this year is Sword, Sword of the Spirit is okay. our theme this year. So, um, yeah. but uh, we're really looking forward to this this conference this year. Um, it's more centralized for the Metroplex and. Uh, and we're happy to yeah, be here today. You'll be proud of this rosary. My uh, co-worker, Doug Pearson, oh, wow. gave me this man's man's rosary, and the cross on it has a sword in the back. See that? That is <laughs> neat, yes. It's talking about the sword of the spirit. This is a this is a man's rosary here. I'm so proud of it. I carry it, with, carry it everywhere I go. I've only had it a few days. All right, so that's the Catholic Men's Conference 2015. It's going to be February 7th. I hope the weather cooperates because, boy, that's... Uh, right there in the winter time but uh, February 7th you could have 80 degrees or you could have you know minus 10 you just never know so I hope the weather cooperates it's going to be at the Hearst, the Hearst Conference Center uh, 1601 the Campus Drive in Hearst not too far from where we are right now which uh, reminds me uh, we are getting to the end of the hour now and uh, you could uh, you can cut the tension with a knife as all everybody <laughs> wonders who's going to win this Visa <laughs> gift card it's what, it's, it's what everybody's mind is right now I'm sure the dear listeners just cannot wait to find out so we have I, I think five or six people in the drawing now maybe, maybe six or seven uh, got their names in a little piece of paper and uh, we're going to do the drawing here in just a few minutes we're going to let uh, Martha Everline uh, uh, be our guest uh, be, be the one to actually draw this uh, before that though uh, and, and, and I want to say thanks to Rick um, Rick real quickly before we let you go uh, the cost of the conference and how can people register the cost is around $40. I'm not 100% sure. We haven't finalized that, but it's pretty close. <laughs> so we can pay around it's, $40? Yeah, it's, uh, it's, I'd like to it's about what we had last you. year. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, and so the, website, the website is uh, www.ntxcmc.org. It's probably kind of early to be registering. Is yeah, it's right? early, but, no registration yet, but right? go on the site and check out okay. all the, the, the information NTXCMC, about NTXCMC.org. Uh, .org. .org. Okay, NTXCMC.org. And as we get closer, especially into next year, uh, gosh, it's, it's going to be early next year in, in February, but maybe the end of this year, early next year, we'll have you on again on our local sure. programs and talk about this. And uh, Joey Assam, is he yep, still? he's in? still involved, okay. heavily involved. And, uh, Kevin Christensen yep. and all those guys. Okay, uh, very good. Well, uh, thank you, Rick. Thank and, you. Uh, thanks for what you're doing. And again, uh, if you're a man or if you're a, uh, a person who knows a man who can be involved in this, I think probably 18 years and up can uh, attend this Catholic Men's Conference. And uh, it's going to be February 7th at the Hearst Con uh, uh, Conference Center, Convention Center, Conference Center uh, in, uh, in Hearst, Texas, here in the Mid-Cities.